Hey guys, welcome back to another cryptocurrency news article. This one comes from the Bitcoinist, and Trollum loses steam as Binance announces TRX delisting after the Justin Sun controversy. So yeah, so well, that's definitely news to make the price go down of Tron, but let's go over this. Binance has announced the delisting of Tron in a move that was carried out after the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission's recent action against the crypto mogul. Now, according to the SEC's press release, the regulatory body charged Justin Sun and his three wholly owned companies, namely Tron Foundation Limited, BitTorrent Foundation Ltd., and Rainberry Inc., a fraud for the unregistered sale of alleged securities to investors. The regulatory body accuses Sun of extensive wash trading, which involves the stimu or simultaneous or near simultaneous purchase and sale of a security to make it appear actively traded without an actual change in beneficial ownership, and for orchestrating a scheme to pay celebrities to tout TRX and BTT without disclosing their compensation. The SEC also charged several celebrities for not disclosing their compensation for touting TRX and BTT illegally. Big names like Jake Paul, Neo, and Lindsay Lohan make up the list. After delisting announcement, TRX went down 5% in the last 24 hours. Fear, uncertainty, and doubt then filled the minds of investors. So the Tron rumors and FUD, the perfect storm is brewing. Just as the announcement went live, rumors spread on Twitter that Justin was arrested when he landed in Hong Kong to attend a cryptocurrency event. Despite the rumors, he was seen freely at the event even tweeting that he met with his mentor, which is Alibaba's former CSO. Here is that tweet from Will Chart breaking rumor Justin Sun has been arrested. So I guess that was false news. But although these recent tweets should have stemmed the FUD around his situation, it is not it has not stopped the bears from taking hold of the market quickly. CoinGlass data reveals that sentiment surrounding the token has not wavered from bearish, with more short positions betting against TRX. Now, long holders were also blown out uh, of the water as of the writing of TRX experienced a half a million dollar liquidation spree, with the majority of these liquidations coming from long positions. At 0.06389 cents, can Tron recover from the FUD? Although the general market sentiment right now is bearish, Sun's recent charges exaggerated the effect on Tron. Bears are currently testing the uh, price support, and however, this may fall in the short term as the latter support is reliable. TRX bulls should then defend the current support as the as this will provide investors a launch pad to follow a possible sentiment flip in the market. Monitoring the situation as it unfolds, we're also clear the FUD giving investors and traders an edge in decision making. Now for long term targeting, six and a half cents will be beneficiary flipping this resistance to support which strengthen the position of long time holders. Now I don't hold any TRX myself so I don't know what I would do. Like, where else you can get? Is it only Binance that was delisting it, or are they still available on other exchanges out there? Or do you uh, go the like anonymous DeFi route side to get it? So I don't know. Let me know on then how you guys feel about this Tron losing steam because of the Binance announcement. I'd love to hear from you. But if you guys did enjoy this article, hit that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and until next time, the Crypto Sherpa is out.